Welcome to Food Technology Department Bina Nusantara University. We are located at Alam Sutra Campus. Let's see around. When they first arrive on campus, they will be asked to do a campus check-in through Binus Mobile. Before attending class, Binusians must fill in the daily health declaration that states that they are physically fit. As a world-class university, Binus University has taken extra precautions for the safety of the Binusians and staff by implementing strict health protocol as advised by the government during the pandemic. Integrated into learning management systems, Binus Maya and Binus Mobile are the health protocol systems for on-site learning. After that, their body temperature will be checked. When all the rules have been implemented, Binusian can enter the classroom. LKC Alam Sutra provide various kinds of collections and already equipped with cutting-edge multimedia facilities that support the lecture process. In addition, other facilities such as meeting rooms can be used by all BINUS students to support activities outside of lectures. The BINUS Alam Sutra Sports Hall can be used for several sports such as basketball, futsal, badminton, volleyball, and others. In addition to focusing on the academic field, BINU students are also expected to develop skills in non-academic fields, one of which is sports. BINUS Alam Sutra Auditorium, which is usually used for lectures with external speakers. This room has 300 people and is often used as a place to hold campus events such as seminars, talk shows, training, and collaboration classes. BINUS University has implemented a multi-channel learning system. Multi-channel learning itself is a series of learning programs developed by combining three main channels. The three channels are face-to-face, -face, which is face-to-face -face lectures, self-study, which trains students to become autonomous learners by looking for material references other than lecturers, and the e-learning channel. In order to support multi-channel learning, BINUS University also holds creative classes supported by the latest technology facilities. In fact, BINUS University has a dedicated online campus for distance education services. Multi-channel learning at BINUS University is supported by the existence of BINUS Maya, an online learning platform that functions as a means of communication between students, lecturers, to the Student Service Center, and Lecturer Service Center. Physics Laboratory is used for physics practicum. A room with a capacity of 20 to 30 students is equipped with learning facilities such as practicum table, whiteboard, computer and projector, as well as work safety support tools. The lab has basic instruments for basic physics practicum. Sensory Laboratory is used for sensory evaluation practicum. It is a room with a capacity of 15 students. The lab has three rooms, namely a discussion room, a sensory booth, and a preparation room. The discussion room is used for material explanations, work instructions, and discussion of practical results. The discussion room is equipped with learning facilities such as a practicum table, whiteboard, computer, and projector. The sensory booth space is used by the panelists for testing. The sensory room has 15 testing booths, where each booth will be used by one panelist and there is access to the preparation room for sample presentation. The preparation room is used to prepare samples equipped with cooking utensils and serving utensils. The chemistry laboratory is used for practicum of chemistry, organic chemistry, basic food biochemistry, food chemistry, and food analysis. A room with a capacity of 20 to 30 students is equipped with learning facilities such as practicum table, whiteboard, computer and projector, as well as work safety support tools. Instruments owned by the chemical laboratory include incubator, water bath, hot plate, desiccator, pH meter, Brookfield viscometer, water activity meter, centrifuge, spectrophotometer, electrophoresis, analytical balance, and fume hood. The microbiology laboratory is used for biology, basic microbiology, food microbiology laboratory, and human nutrition practicums with capacity of 20 to 30 students. It is equipped with learning facilities such as a practicum table, whiteboard, computer and projector, as well as work safety support tools. 
Instruments available at the microbiology laboratory include ovens, incubators, water baths, microscopes, freezers, ultra freezers, and laminar airflow. The food processing laboratory is used for food processing practicum, workshop, and final project research. A room with a capacity of 20 to 30 students is equipped with learning facilities such as practicum table, whiteboard, computer and projector, as well as work safety support tools. The food processing laboratory is equipped with several instruments including freezer, oven, vacuum sealer, mixer, texture analyzer, freeze drying, and ice cream maker. Food processing lab also has cooking utensils and kitchen utensils. It is an information media for students to ask questions or get information about lectures, exams, and registration. Student Advisory and Support Center, or SASC, is one of the supporting units that provide assistances and services for students in both academic and non-academic matters and conduct various activities to support students during their study at Venus University. SASC consists of three subunits, Counseling, Mentoring, and Disability Services. Lecturer Service Center is a place where lecturers and students can discuss, conduct academic advisory, prepare lectures, and other activities related to teaching and learning activities. Students can also discuss attendance at LSC. This is it from Food Technology Department, Bina Nusantara University. Thank you.